Hey, welcome to Physics Everywhere. For this video, we're going to take a look at converting inches into centimeters. So if we look at a ruler, on the top we've got our centimeters and millimeters, and on the bottom we've got our inches. So here is one imperial inch. I'm just going to take this slider and move it over. And you'll notice that one inch is just slightly over two and a half centimeters. So the actual conversion is one inch is equivalent to 2.54 centimeters. Let's take a look at an example. So I would like to convert 6.50 inches into centimeters. So we will use our ratio of 2.54 centimeters per inch. So this right here is just simply the number one. So we have not mathematically changed anything. There's 2.54 centimeters in an inch. So this number right here, this ratio is just the number one. The reason why we've done this is because we have an inch on the bottom, which cancels off with the inch or plural inches on the top. So now we simply have 6.50 times 2.54 and we get 16.51 centimeters. Now, this is what the calculator gives us. If we go back and look at the original number that was given, this has one, two, three significant digits. Our final answer has one, two, three, four. So our final answer has to reflect the least number of significant digits from the question, which means the final answer should be 16.5 centimeters. So 6.5 inches is equivalent to 16.5 centimeters. A lot of times inches will be used with fractions. So if we go back to our ruler, you'll notice they're putting fractions in here. So this would be called a half an inch. This is three quarters of an inch. So when you're using the imperial system, a lot of times instead of putting a decimal, they will actually put a fraction. So before we do the conversion, we'll have to take this eight and three quarters of an inch and take the three quarters and turn it into a decimal. So three quarters simply means three over four. Three over four is equivalent to 0.75. So eight and three quarters inches is the same thing as writing 8.75 inches. So now we're gonna use our conversion. So in this case, I have my 2.54 centimeters divided by inch. Just as a recap, that symbol of, it looks like a quotation mark, this also means inches. Now it's a bit of a strange system, but I've got inches on the top and I've got inches on the bottom. So that cancels off. And then when we do 8.75 times 2.54, we end up getting 22.225 centimeters. Now, this is our original number. This has one, two, three significant digits. Our answer has one, two, three, four, five. So we can't have five significant digits in our final answer, so we need to round it. If we round it to three significant digits, we get 22.2 centimeters. So there's a video on how to convert inches both in decimal and in fraction, into centimeters. 